Hey, what's up, guys? Um, it's me, Luke MC, and today I'm going to be telling you guys how to bypass an administrator password on like a school computer, a library computer, a uh, family member's computer, and you're on a guest account, which doesn't have administrator privileges. So, this works on mostly anything that you want to download, uh, like Knox uh, and Pivot Animator, and so on and so forth or to run things as an administrator. <clears throat> so the first thing you want to do is go down here to Cortana, search Notepad, or just click the Notepad if it's already there, in like in the corner. Right there, not the corner. Anyways, uh, what you want to do is copy and paste in here the code that I'm putting in the link in, no, not a link, I'm just putting it in the description. <laughs> um, <clears throat> so then when you're done pasting the code into the notepad, press file, then save as. Yeah, make sure it saves to desktop so it's easy to find. Then down here where it says save as type, click this and click all files. Then name it whatever you want. I'm naming it admin bypass. That's not how you spell bypass. There we go. And then, don't put dot .text, put dot .bat, and then save. See, see, now it's right here. Then you can close that. So here's just proof that it doesn't, uh, that it works. So let's see, pivot animator. Click that. That's the install. I need a administrator password for this. Now, if I take this and drag it over admin bypass, it'll run the code. Sorry, I had an itch. And then open. <clears throat> so uh, that's pretty much everything. So I'll see you guys.